There we go. Last person. Okay. Let's try this. Oh man, they can't reach high enough. Hmm. Oh, I know what to do. There. That should be. Okay, I hope this works. Yes! It worked! Hi guys, Ray23179 here, and today I'm going to be doing a mod review on the More Pistons mod for Minecraft 1.4.6, and I'm also going to be showing you a tutorial of how to install it. Okay, so before the intro, you saw this work of magic here, and this is an addition with the More Pistons mod. It's a uh, pretty cool, pretty cool thing. But anyway, let's move on to the next part of this mod. Now see, I have three pistons, well four pistons laid out like this. Are they all the same? No, they're not. They're very different. This is the normal piston, this is the double piston, this is the triple piston, and this is the quadruple piston. These pistons all have different reach lengths. The normal piston takes up two blocks of space when it's pushed out. Double takes up three, triple takes up four, and quadruple takes up five. So that is all the pistons added to this mod. And a good use for putting them in a sequence like this is like a compact expandable um compact expandable staircase per se. Um instead of making some big redstone creation, you have this compact staircase that could fit in your in a small house. Instead of some big redstone creation. Um now this is one the last piston added to this mod. Um, it is the gravitational piston. And if I stand on it here and I activate it, it will send me flying up into the air. Now, um, I'm not sure if there's something wrong with my computer or if there's a bug in the mod, but gravitational pistons are supposed to work for sand too because when sand uh, gets a block taken out from under it, it falls. So, it, it falls down, so I don't know why, but when I put a sand on here and activate it, it doesn't shoot it up into the air. It just sits there, like a normal piston. It should also work to shoot mobs up into the air, but it's not working on my computer. Again, I don't know if that's a bug or um, a bug that needs to be fixed or my computer. Um, now the crafting recipes. Um, four of the crafting recipes of this mod aren't working with me, so bear with me here. I will show you those four now. Alright, so first, to craft the double piston, you do this. Piston there, stick, and planks across the top. Normally you get a double piston, but I don't know why. It's just not working with me. Either that or a bug in the mod. And then to make the triple piston, you put the double piston in the normal piston's place. And you'll get, you should get a triple piston. Uh, this is how you craft the quadruple piston. And if you put a quadruple piston there, it doesn't do anything. Doesn't give you anything. There's no Sintopo piston or whatever. Um, now, everyone knows, well, everyone should know the crafting recipe for a sticky piston. Just do slime ball on top of a piston. Well, it works the same for all the other pistons. If you do double, you get the double sticky piston. If you do triple, you get the triple sticky piston. If you do quadruple, you get the quadruple sticky piston. Um, last crafting recipe that's working with me right now is the piston with TNT on top, and that's how you craft the gravitational piston. That's all the crafting recipes for this mod. And um, now, I'm just going to get into uh, showing you guys how to install this. Okay guys, here we are on our Mac desktop. Um, I have on here in the middle of my screen the two files that you're going to need to install this mod. Um, to retrieve these files, you'll need to go to the Minecraft Forge link in the uh, description. And we'll take you to MinecraftDL.com. You scroll down until you see this. Download Forge Universal for Minecraft 1.4.6 now. 
You click that, it will take you to a download page. It's not AdFly, I don't know what it is, but it's a download page and it will download it for you. Then you need to go to the More Persons mod itself, that download, that link in the description, and ignore these because that's not the real thing. I don't know how they put it there. And even on the page itself, they have the crafting recipes. That's exactly what we did, but it still didn't work for some reason. I don't know why. Um, and then right here we have Download More Pistons 1.4.6 for Minecraft 1.4.6. Click that, and this one will actually give you an ad fly download, and where you need to wait five seconds. Uh, just do that, and you should have these two files. The More Pistons is actually a zip file, and Minecraft Forge is a folder. Um, I don't think it will be named Minecraft Forge 1.4.6. I just go. Ahead, I just renamed it. Um, but to install these, hold on. Let me get out of the way. To install these, we're gonna go to our Minecraft folder. And like in the previous video, I told you all that most people don't have Minecraft in their sidebar here. So um, to get there, for the sake of the people who haven't seen the previous video. It's on the top of the screen. You go to Finder, Library, Application Support, then Minecraft, and it should take you to this page. Um, you'll have all of these in here. And first, we're going to install Minecraft Forge because you have to do that first, first or it won't work. So go ahead and open the bin, and you should have all these files in here. Um, highlight the Minecraft.jar file by clicking it once. Press Enter and rename it. Um, go to the end of it and type in um, .zip and then the file will be named minecraft.jar.zip click away from it and then this will come up just select use.zip and there we have it it's a zip file minecraft.jar.zip double click it and open it and it will unzip it with an archive utility and we will be left with the minecraft.jar folder we can go ahead and move the minecraft.jar.zip to the trash because we don't need it anymore uh, now we're going to open the minecraft.jar and we should have a bunch of class files now we're going to open the minecraft forge download and there should be a bunch of class files in here too. Select any one by clicking it once and then select them all by doing Command A. And then you can right click it and then copy 231 items. It should be 231. If it's not, you probably downloaded the wrong thing. So go back and do it again. But it should be 30, 231. So we're going to copy that. Now you can close Minecraft Forge download. And um, we go in here. I'm just changing it to pictures. And then I right click and then click paste. And if we wait for a second, this copy warning should come up. You check the box that says apply to all and then click replace. And it will put them in there. There we go. Okay, now what we do, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to move Minecraft Forge up here because we've already installed it. And now we're going to install the more pistons mod. Um, Minecraft Forge has already been installed in case you haven't noticed. Um, in your fresh Minecraft folder, most people don't have this. But we're going to right click and do new folder and name it mods. If you already have this, you don't have to make another one. Um, then we're going to open our mods folder and then just drag the more pistons mod file. It's a dot zip. Keep it as a dot zip. Don't unzip it or anything like that. Keep it as a dot zip and just drag it into that mods folder. And the, two, and the more pistons mod and Minecraft Forge have been installed. And you're going to want to run your Minecraft because you just installed Forge and get it used to that and stuff. And basically all Minecraft Forge does is checks to make sure what mods you have. And this is completely normal. It needs to validate launching your Minecraft. And it needs to do that to check what mods you have installed. Then we're just going to wait for it to load. And it should load. And right here this tells you that Forge has been installed. And there's when you're using a bunch of crap. And then Minecraft Forge 6.5.0.0. 473. This is the current version of Forge that you should be using. Um, and then it says four mods loaded and four mods active. You can check in here. There's four. Um, the Minecraft Coder Pack, Forge Mod Loader, and Minecraft Forge, all of those are working together to create the Minecraft Mod Forge, but it doesn't really do anything to your game. And more pistons is all we need to worry about. As long as it's in here, you're good. And um, that four mods loaded, whatever that number is, you just subtract 3 from it, and that's your actual number of mods. So 4 minus 3 is 1, which means we're good because we only have one mod installed, and that's the More Pistons mod. So, yeah, that's how you install Minecraft Forge and the More Pistons mod for Minecraft 1.4.6. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you found it helpful. Like, subscribe, and all that stuff. And I will see you later.